guys, back with another video. Today, I wanted to talk about a struggle that I've been having for the past basically three months, trying to upgrade from Windows 10 1909 to Windows 10 20 H2, which is the big October update. I had tried everything. I was, and I, by the way, I finally got this to work. I tried everything. I tried the normal Windows update, and it was stalling at 61%. I tried uh, using the Windows Update Assistant, and that would stall at 99%, and I let it run for 20 hours, and it didn't work. Then I tried using the Media Creation Tool, and that didn't work. Uh, I basically flashed the BIOS and updated the BIOS on my machine. I updated all the drivers. I spent hours and hours trying to figure this out to no avail. Finally, I stumbled across a post that mentioned this Connextant, I think it's pronounced, audio driver issue incompatibility, C-O-N-E-X-A-N-T, Connextant, audio driver incompatibility. And I said to myself, well, I didn't see those drivers because I went into this PC, I went into the device manager, and I didn't see any specific drivers for this Connextant audio driver. And then what I did was I just happened to be looking in the um, Windows program folder under Sennheiser, okay, which I have a Sennheiser GSP350 headphones, which I'm actually using right now, okay, and they're great headphones. And I just happened to be looking at this, and I said, geez, maybe there's something with this that I, and I saw this smart audio, and smart audio was tied with this Connextant audio driver. And then all I did was I hovered over this, this um, setup thing, and all of a sudden this little block came up here, and it showed company, Connextant Systems. And I said, wait a second, did Sennheiser use connect these Connextant audio drivers that I read about have an incompatibility with 20H2? So let me try something. And I uninstalled everything to do with Sennheiser from my machine. Okay, the and I made sure everything was removed. After I did that, lo and behold, all I did was I went to uh, the Windows upgrade, upgrade, and I started the update again. And guess what? It worked, and I within one hour, I was updated. So basically, there is an issue with Sennheiser's use of these Connextant audio drivers that is causing Windows 10 to basically stall its upgrade update to 20H2. Now, I don't know if this incompatibility goes beyond that. I've emailed Sennheiser to let them know about this issue, and hopefully they'll fix it or come up with some solution. I basically noticed that uh, this is updated now because I just had to reinstall these drivers. But I noticed that we had installed this on my machine right before the time when the October update came out for Windows 10. So that basically was a comedy of errors. Installing this caused that update not to happen, right? So the answer is if you're struggling with this with this problem, make sure you look at whatever device you're using for audio to see if this Connextant audio driver is installed or anything to do with Connextant is installed on your machine and get rid of it and then try your uh, your update. And what I did was I basically went and uninstall and I looked for the Sennheiser audio and I just uninstalled that and that got rid of all the drivers. So just so you could see here, uh, my current right now my current version is 20H2, which is what I've been trying to upgrade for for the past three months. You can see I installed it today on the 4th of, uh, of January, 2021. Hopefully that'll work for you. It worked for me. You know, I you know I was a little miffed because I literally have spent three months trying to do this and couldn't find the issue. And I was at the point where I was going to re basically reset Windows, and that would have taken more time to rebuild everything on the C drive. But thankfully, I stumbled upon hovering over on this setup and saw that Connextant Systems and said, "Wow, I I remember reading something about this causing an issue." put two and two together, uninstall that, then try the update and it worked like a charm. So hopefully this will work for you. Uh, if you're experiencing this type of issue, hit just put something in the comments. I would love to hear about it. Uh, hit that like button if you like what you saw and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more PC gaming PC tech advice and help. Hope this was helpful, guys. Have a great day.